Welcome back to Let's Play Stasis. Last time, I blew myself up and there was a cat. And apparently some sort of club. But in any case, we have a ladder now. Let's see where it leads. Through the massive wound left in the side of the shaft, a sturdy maintenance ladder that survived the explosion can be seen. Tia, I can get back up to the crew quarters. Uh, stuff coming out from under that door that worries me okay okay I've still got the hologram emitter <gasps> motion detector security door I'm gonna go poke the security panel first though Atmospheric control override. Let's not mess with that door. Let's go back to the security security room. Oh, wait. No, never mind. I need to go past here. That's the room that we locked. Because Samantha wanted to eat me. But she got fed by a dead body, so hopefully... <laughs> Finally, a puzzle that logics. Good thing it doesn't require a separate power source, I suppose. Wait, where's the door? Ah, screw no. How does door? I forget. That, that, that's a. Oh, there we go. There we go. Life support. Atmospherics. I can understand why they had all the extra security. And PDAs. Can I disable that now? No, really? Ugh. I don't want that pantsing around on my screen. Uh, slumped over dead body. Rigor mortis has left. I was reading that. Rigor mortis has left his body in a parody of a worker man managing the controls. Okay, now you can investigate the body. Is this it? Could this really be my golden opportunity? I've been transferred to security with a guy named Paul and some other guy whose name I don't quite remember. It sounded kind of like Sarge, so maybe I'm just going to call him Sarge. Either way, I'm glad. Maybe I'll finally make real friends. Paul is mean, but Sarge is okay. It looks like food supplies aren't coming in anytime soon. People seem upset, but there's a lot of alcohol around. I don't drink much because my dad used to and it got scary sometimes. Sarge is still nice when he's drunk though, even though he said I'd make a pretty girl. One of those drunks, huh? We got a mystery package from the cloning vats today. I was even allowed to type the terminal entry. It's supposed to go to lab 18. Sarge says we're gonna put it in medical storage bay for now though. It makes really scary noises. It's named Samantha. I liked a girl named Samantha once, but then this guy, Anthony, was stalking her and she moved away. Paul just read that over my shoulder and reminded me that the PDAs are for work-related logs only. I don't like Paul. Sarge says I can type whatever I want. The whole ship just shook a whole lot. Power is out everywhere. Everything is locked down, but we can get through some of it because we're security. I hope nobody got hurt when things were flying around in here. Well, I admit one tickets. Anyway. Uh, people are trying to get Tram Station B to work because A is closed. I think we're fi I think we killed some people today. Sarge is angry. He's beating on the window. I'm so confused. How did you think you killed people today? I want to know the story behind that. I'm sorry my nose keeps cringing. I, I feel a tickle like I'm going to sneeze, but it's not coming. Okay, now let's mess with the atmospheric access control terminal. Attention. Atmosphere vented in tram station B. Why did I just do that? How did that help me at all? I mean, typically venting at the atmosphere is reducing it to a vacuum. I thought I was going to come out of that door. I was staring there and then I saw him come out and I jumped. <laughs> 
I'm gonna go ahead and do a quick save also. Just in case. that it affects y'all. I guess I'd just jump that over it if I randomly died, monitors. Okay, that did not help me anyway. Entertainment block. Tram station. That's where I need. Go the other way. Marks. Something was trying to get in. That's good information. A security panel will unlock the door, I presume. I assume had I done that before, I'd have been sucked into a vacuum. I found her. Your daughter is in the medical bay. All right, let's do this. That blood worries me. Whoa, why do you glow? We're going to click the... I said... Specimen transport. Click the glowy thing, but okay, you can just ignore that. Black resin permeates Literally through small generation. perforations in the crate walls. I can't do anything here. I see how it is. Project Kitchen Knife. Faint scratching noise is heard coming from the plastic box. Well, I have a feeling I know what they're trying to do. All kinds of weird experiments. Let's follow the blood! Tim, the tram isn't operational. What do you mean? Can you fix it? No. No, I don't think so. There is no other way out of there. There has to be. Let me look around. Fuck, this is all falling apart. I didn't realize that was the tram. It's that destroyed. We request your cooperation. Okay, I guess those are just emergency lights. In a positive manner. There's a corpse. That one has a face. Plastic container has seen its fair share of use. Project Seed. What? Oh, nothing. Just reading out loud. Sealed, was hydroponic. sealed lid of the container is caked in a reeking green mold. Skull and crossbones warning sticker peels up at its edges, indicating this container was once used to transport dangerous cargo. Medical bay. This is it. Does that mean if I get inside the container and put it in the specimen transport, it will send me to the medical bay? Or do I need the... The what? There's no information here. Time to use the drill! I don't think that'll work. It's the only thing I got left. Gnarled wreckage of twisted steel sits hazardously in wait. Well, what else can I do? Hmm. Hmm, I say. Very many homes. I assume moving these would control the desk. Ah, okay. I thought those were switches, like up and down. Those are patterns, so I need to match the pattern for the medical bay. A friend of mine introduced me to a I don't know if I mentioned it a while back. A friend of mine introduced me to a wonderful program known as Print Screen. Oh no, Light Shot. Where's my mouse pointer? Oh dear. I broke the game. Oh, there we go. Uh, very nice for taking screenshots of part of the screen, but uh, be sure to have a paint window open to put the screenshot in. I mean, to put the piece in if it's something you need to look at while playing a game. 
Also helps to have multiple monitors. In any case, I need... Nope. 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 Yes. Nope. 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 Yes. Medical bay! Oh god, I thought something was gonna jump out of it at me. So, I'm gonna- This is either brilliant or very, very stupid. Kind of yeah. Basically those air chutes that they use at banks. Oh, no, never mind, I'm just being carried in a crate. What could possibly go wrong? Quantum devices are not permitted in specimen storage. Quarantine procedures initiated. Quantum storage device reset. I wanted my room! Okay, let's see what we can see. This definitely looks like the medical facilities. I think I'm on the right track. Yeah, you're on the medical bay level one. Your daughter is four decks below you. She is so close, John. So close. But, but, but my neural drill, that was my one weapon to defend myself from Samantha, who's hopefully far, far away right now. I'm gonna go ahead and save again. Don't judge me. I regret, I don't... This is strange. Uh, I'm not reading any PDTs in your area. Yeah. They should remain active. Even on the Tell me, John. Why are you working with this jackal? Dr. Milan. Ah. <sighs> She's been talking about me. Look, I'm nobody. I just want to find my family. Without a family. Man alone. I don't know. I, I, without knowing more about what happened, I could very she could very well be the bad guy for all I know. Also, security guns. That's that's worrisome. Uh, yes. What I was going to say before is I regret nothing when I walked in the room and saw all the bloodstains. Great. Not opening anytime soon. Vending machine has been knocked over, but probably not by an employee. Kane Corporation certainly didn't subsidize the price of these sodas. Motion activated. Please don't make me listen to the whole thing again. This is strange. Ah, I'm not reading any PTs. Ah, they should remain active. Ah, okay, jump cut. No, oh, okay, we're back. Good saving. Because every time I had to go through that again. Well, I mean once, but okay. Motion sensitive gun turrets. Let's walk around. 
at the vending machine. That is the most disturbing advertisement I have ever heard. Can I throw the soda out there and have the guns shoot each other? Okay, so somehow I'm supposed to trigger the guns so that they just shoot each other. My theory would be to shake up a soda, throw it so that it bounces and begins dancing around, spewing. And I have a load for this. Load and bypass that whole chat chat chatty chat. Oh crud, now I gotta hear that again. Banned in several colonies, Juca Cola is a highly addictive, absurdly potent blast of sugar and stimulants. Never liked Juca Cola. <laughs> It does not like me pushing it. Okay. Can I just push the whole machine? Yes. A little more. Now get back. Run. You clearly didn't finish shooting it, it's still jabbering away. Can I take the gun? One step at a time, we're getting there. Defrost the next clone and bring him out. That is not what I'm looking for. Aren't you glad that Coke machines are quiet? Uh, I think that would break. I'm gonna go into the service duct. That was plan B. Dead body. A pistol. Where am I? Oh, please don't be that close. Oh, emptied weapon. Let's check the dead body. So there's no safe haven for that poor soul. Found the body too. He's pretty bloodied up. No response, huh? Couldn't detect his PDT. I'm suspicious of you. More power and outages today. I thought they had a lid on that. People have been way crankier than usual. One of my boys just broke down today, shaking and scratching like he was suffering from withdrawal or something. Checked with the nurses who examined him and it seemed like there was some sort of drug in his system. He swore blind he wasn't dirty and he hadn't been taking anything, but they were already preparing a tribunal for the poor guy. The thing is, I believe him. Everybody's been acting a bit peculiar today. Clearly he just drank some of the juca. What's happening to my beautiful ship? That stuff is growing up the spine of the baby like cancer. I keep mailing Dr. Milan about it, but he hasn't responded to any of my messages. I know he's reading them because I get more of those stooges from hydroponics down to collect samples whenever I send more than a few words his way. I managed to corner his assistant the other day and demanded to know when she'd be getting our share of the rations. Oh, when we'd be getting our share. She better not be getting our share of the rations. She looked at me like she hadn't slept in a week and said, soon. None of us are sleeping properly. I tried to greet each day with a smile, but the wrenches are getting panicky. If not mutinous, I spend my time breaking up fights instead of maintaining the engines. I was thinking of taking a group down to engine ports and torching, the, torching that stuff off the hull, but I'm worried it's too late for that now. I think wrench would be a kind of slander term for the mechanics. No more engineer, maybe engineers, I don't know. No more engineers, no more hope. When you take those things away, you got nothing left. I'm dictating this wedge to under the main security terminal. I don't think any of those things will hear me. The rest of the survivors are holed up in the bulkheads, but nobody was willing to risk leaving until we had some sort of protection. I pointed out that we'd either starve or die anyway, so they voted overwhelmingly for me to try to get help. So 
I came down here through the maintenance access tunnels and programmed the security terminal to mark any of the individuals with their PDT still implanted as hostiles. That should at least get the turrets on our side. I'm not sure it'll work, but it's all I could do. I'm alone right now, but I'm used to it. Never met the right girl and all that. Pretty sure I heard Lotus screaming, you know. They're probably all dead now, but I can't know for sure. I could hear those things peeling panels off the floor and walls like they were paper. And they will not find me cowering under the floor like that. Guy Fox jumped th with the noose around his neck when he was about to be executed. Did you know that? They were going to half strangle him and rip him to pieces, but he cheated the executioners, breaking his own neck before they could carry on torturing him. I'm going to do likewise. Got a gun for my protection, see? Got one bullet left, but no matter. I only need one. Let's check the sentry gun controls. Well, that one's been blasted. And a stack of empty Juca Cola stands sits below. Clearly, the turret gun has been drinking on the job. Is there any way for me to deact anything? I click, it just goes. Okay, whatever. Get that pistol. There's nothing else around there. Sickening odor of death and rot wafts into the room, making you gag from its nauseating scent. The air in the tunnel alternates between stale and putrid with decay. Well, how am I? The turret is poised to spring into the room above and eliminate any unauthorized personnel. Wait, what if I jam a Juca Cola this into it? Well, it's got other empties. What's the difference? I don't think that'll work. I don't think this will fit. Well, we've got one option, and that's shut down the gun. I'm assuming I can't. No, that's ridiculous. That's just crazy. Although these don't go well together. Well, that's all of them. <laughs> Is there anything I can do with the sentry gun to make it not spring? It's like, I'm down here. Replace cable sleeving. Did you just go... Under Kruska. Get me out of here. Just let's stand on it. That's clearly the smartest thing to do. I just didn't use the cola on the right thing. Use the cola on the control computer. <laughs> when in doubt, pour soda on it. Ok, 
Okay, that was weird. Uh, moving forward. Now we can go here. I don't know. One override. Coming up. Play Minecraft enough. Doors save lives. Shit, John. The security systems in medical are inaccessible. It's like they've been locally reset. I can't access anything. I'll think of something. It's glass. Just breaking. smack. Yes, we're breaking the door. That's the point. Hmm. Gun is most likely general security, though desperate measures have been instituted to control Juca Cola addicts in certain situations. Not what I expected to happen, but okay. That's potent. And then it is. I'm gonna go ahead and pause here. And we'll find out what's beyond the door next time. See you next time.